hello guys welcome back to Kobe's kitchen is a new yeah consider subscribing today let's talk about kipika stew to your minji waru nyama so fry your onions until they are golden brown or whatever translucent in color am i in a and then put a lot of carrots and also one one green cup you let it simmer for like a minute or two until they are nicely cooked and like not fully fully cooked because they are obviously going to cook as the stew boils i'm going to add in salt a generous amount Then simmer for a minute before we add in our other ingredients. After about a minute, we may simmer with ready, so we add in our spices. So, in case I don't know, I'm going to prepare. So, I'll go in with a tablespoon of paprika, and then a teaspoon of ginger powder. Then a uh, tablespoon of curry powder. I really love this one from Royco. You can add any other if you like. But me, but me, a piece of for today. Here, Royal Blue Jeans incorporating well with your other ingredients so I'm going to add in my mawari mm-hmm. let the spices get in the gravy before we add in the rest I also uh, add uh, like a pre-cooker kg of beef for whatever meat or a sikuku, I'm a pork. So be, I'm a goat, you do. So I let the spices go in. They were used in the yama, and then we add in the rest. So simmer for again about a minute or two. After it is a little bit of After about a minute, that can come as in a shake out of skinny, so you can go to the chicken. I'll now add in my cheese. Uh, I think it's about two pages. Two pages, yeah. I'm going to put it in the pan. I really love mungu a lot, a lot. I will eat mungu every day. So they are already prepared. Mm-hmm. And then we add in a blended uh, three tomatoes and uh, five cloves of garlic. So that's what I'm adding in. And then I will wait for another two minutes. Before I add in my beef broth, I come out to me in the boil yam and matching just add in water. So, yeah, so, so after I name it, we are now going to add in our beef broth. You see, I can imagine to give you my first half of work too until if you make your address and then you're good to go. You just wait now for it. See, okay. Maji Kamamoto. So yeah, we we'll now let this cook. Uh because everything is cooked is both the waru. So when the waru cook and adjust your seasoning. Uske kama salty meshika vizuri and then we now wait it for it to cook. Mine kosa. So just wait for it to cook 
and then we'll show you the final results. We garnish it with dania ikiva and then we enjoy with chapati. After around 10 minutes, we may pick in the zuri and the warus is in eva vizuri. So I'll now garnish it with my dania and I'm going to choose with a dog or two just a minute and then I put off the heat. So see you on the next one. Subscribe if you haven't. Bye bye.